Hey there everyone, this is MarkyMan64 here welcoming you to a new LP. That's right, we are playing Goat Simulator 3 on the PlayStation 5. So this game just came out today, it was just released today, I just got it like about half an hour ago in the mail, um, I had pre-ordered it, I'd pre-ordered it in the Goat in a Box edition, which means I've got some uh, postcards and posters and I've also got a soft toy, which is a goat that looks very much similar to the goat on the screen just now. Um, so I'm just going to say now that I don't know how much of this game I'm going to be playing. Um, I have played the first game quite a lot. I've completed the, the main game and then I've I've got like um, the DLC that came with it and I, I actually bought it on like so many different places that it's, it's quite hilarious. It's an inside joke between me and one of my mates. So um, yes, I, I do have the first game. I thought from the looks of things that this was just going to be more of the same, only just better. Um, so I thought I would kind of blind let's play it but I can't guarantee that I'm going to 100% it because I don't know what the scope of the game is. So let's just dive right in without further ado. New game. Let's see what happens. Okay. Fun, fun loading screens. But loading is very fast. Fair Meadows Ranch, Coffee Stain North is, is the name of the studio. Okay, so, okay, is, is it Skyrim or something that starts like this, where you're in the, in the, the hey, cart? You're finally awake. I'm your new owner. I will look back at you, but I need to look at a road. Safety first, you know, 10 and 2 and all that. Anyway, <laughs> this is the perfect time to give you all the backstory you need. Are you sit there looking around? Exposition, as they call it. Most movies and games do this a lot, actually. But you might not Exposition. even have noticed it half the time. Oh, look! Pigs! Whoa, Close one! Where was I? Oh, right! I should really start explaining things before this intro ends. Don't have too much roll left. Look, we're almost there! Okay, so, where do I begin? I captured you because you have quite the reputation. Wreaking havoc in Goatville and Goat City Bay. Rumor has it you even went up to space. Not sure how much of that is true, though. A lot of copycats or copy goats popping up here and there, trying to steal your funnel. But that was then, and this is now, and now you're mine. I'll train you to become the best goat ever. You gon' make me feel feel rich. I'm gonna milk you dry. Ain't nothing gonna stop this dynamic duo. Or trio, or quartet. You know this is a multiplayer game, right? Is he finished? So this is a direct sequel to the... Let me just come round back. Let's see if I... Uh, can I turn... Oh, he's still moving. Turn on subtitles? Yes. Oh, okay. Turn on dialogue subtitles. See that thing? That tower? You see it? That gold tower that looks super cool. Like a bit too cool to be built for a simple, stupid goat like you. You see it? Right over there. Just follow my finger. That thing is your home from now on. I heard some rumors online that those goat towers are some kind of entrance to a secret place. That sounds a bit too out there if you ask me. Maybe you should investigate. Just promise me you'll go to the goat tower after this way too long intro ends. Man, to be honest, I can't believe you haven't skipped it. Well, since you're still here, have a little token of my appreciation. Now, get out of my Skyrim cart and go to the goat tower. Have fun. Please don't refund. Bye now. My brother was a goat. 
Yes. Okay. So it appears that this is and yeah. So I'll, I'll, I'll obviously get trophies if I'm if I'm getting trophies, and I'll get trophies on the screen. Um, this appears to be a pretty much direct sequel to to Goat Simulator One. By the way, that's the joke that there's been no Goat Simulator Two. It's uh, going straight on to Goat Simulator Three, as far as I know. <laughs> like. Um, it's Goat Simulator 1, but um, yeah, he was he was mentioning the things that happen in Goat Simulator 1 and yeah, the controls are pretty much exactly the same as Goat Simulator 1 as well. Um, I, I did go to space in the main game, you also went to space in the the DLC, which I might play at some point. Uh, if this if this goes quite well, then who knows? I might do that. Um, I, like the first game, you've got tasks in the top. I can't remember what they are called. Um, let's see. Yeah, they're they're they've got a name. That thing in the top right hand top left hand corner, sorry, has a name. And, oh yeah, you've got trinkets to collect. So yeah, it is very similar to the first game. And you'll ragdoll, yeah. Ragdoll. Okay, and then you can, yeah, okay. Okay, so I'm, I'm pretty much getting there. But this is very similar to the f first game. With this, you have a tower in the first game. It does pretty much, and it, it, you know, it does look like it takes you to a similar place as the first game. Can I? Oh, it's so similar. I know I keep saying that, but it's so similar, which is refreshing because I was panicked about it not being, just in case I was like, okay, completely confused, but no, like. And as I said, I don't know how much of the game I'm going to be playing the let's play. I can't promise that I'll 100% it. I, I will if I, if I, if I can, but why is it not teleporting me to anywhere? Synchronize? What does synchronize mean? Oh. Okay. So that's different, because it, yeah, okay. <laughs> so it's kind of beating expectations there. Sync with the goat tower. Ah, okay, okay, I know what it is now, right, okay, it's like a, a region tower uh, in games. It's like, they do parody things in, in Goat Simulator and obviously they were parodying Skyrim and they even name dropped Skyrim with that with that cart at the start. I've never played Skyrim but obviously I know what it what happens in it. Um and they are now parodying these like Ubisoft type towers. Okay. So this is similar to the place that we came to in the first game. Similar but not exactly the same. In fact, it might be the same place that you've teleported to. So you need to get through that door. Okay. Feels like there's like like bigger tasks. Not that there wasn't like big tasks in the first game, but it feels like there's uh, bigger tasks in this game that I need to like complete. Yeah, it's, it's crazy the some of the physics. <laughs> Like wall jumping and wall running and things like that. Let's say uh, receive reward. What's my reward? Okay, so one of the chains is removed. You can see the tasks in the top left hand corner. Receive your first reward. 
Okay, it looks like that's the, the reward. I, I have watched a couple of, like, clips of the of the the game as it's come out on like review websites and stuff um but i've not gone in depth i've just watched like few second clips of it so i do not know what happens absorb wisdom okay instincts that's the word and that is uh where is it there we go uh, so you can do different challenges and you'll get like what looks like money but I think you then buy like costumes and stuff with this this money uh, okay so where is that goat that came through with the hard hat has he disappeared so I was kind of hoping to kill him <laughs> It's just so much chaos. It's just it's such a random game, but it's so fun. And he did mention that there's been like copycats of it and stuff. It's quite meta. So have I to have I to open up the where are we? Instincts. <laughs> where is it? Right, wardrobe. So I'm guessing that you can buy yeah, costumes with the different Okay, ear tag. Let's let's do an ear tag. Um okay. Where are instincts though? I'm pressing that and it's I'm sure yeah, it's going to different places, that's quite weird. It's a quest at the top and pin an instinct. Is that just gonna Pin an instinct. Okay, backflip. I need to go to a high point and ragdoll. Can I not do anything else in here? Is that is that us done this? I think so. Sorry, the initial what's happening with the physics over here? Um the initial thing is gonna be a bit random. And I don't know, like, we might... Yeah, why me? <laughs> they said that in the first game as well. Um, like, I don't know the, what the scope of this game. I have no idea. Like, I would imagine it's, you know, fairly big, but... Let's take him... Haha. <laughs> Okay, use R1 near anyone to make them ride you. Use R1 again to buck them off. Let's go up to this farmer guy. Is he going to go back into his place? Yeah. There we go. Let's take him. And hijack vehicle. Oh, wow. Let's do that. Okay, I want you off me, sir. I'm ragdolling. <laughs> right, okay. Hijack the vehicle. Okay. Okay, the vehicle physics. I think you could do this. Could you do this in the the first game? I'd like to say you could do it in one of the DLC. But I might be wrong. Yeah, you could do it. But then the, the driving physics are a lot better in this game. A lot better. Okay, I'm just exploring. <laughs> is that is that a news report? Yeah. <laughs> okay. There we go. Um, yeah, it does appear that just the scope of the game is a lot bigger. So, where shall we go? Can I can I see myself driving? Okay, I'm just leaning, <laughs> leaning out, leaning out the car. Okay. What is up here? There's just so much to explore. I'm I'm gonna take the first couple of episodes just to kind of get my bearings. Are these are these people heart vocalizations? Does that what that said? Is that like a new instinct that comes up? I think it I think it is like when you go somewhere. 
you've got new instincts. Okay, that, that looks too tempting. How big is the explosion going to be? I've also, while I'm recording this, I've also got a bit of a cough that's annoying me, but, um, the grind, there we go. Got a bit of a cough, so I will try and mute, mute the coughing when I do cough. Okay, can I, oh, okay, bounced on container tarp, okay. Oh, okay. Whoa, we okay. I don't know what I collected there. <laughs> I was I was so uh, taken aback. <laughs> what I want to do is land up here if I can, and then walk along this. There we go. Oh, okay, okay. It's a yeah. Okay, it's sending it up there. Okay, I never realised that. Oh, can I drive it? Yeah, I can drive the tractor. So did I just go right around? Where's map? Okay. Okay, wow, okay. So these are going to be goat towers. Yeah. These are going to be goat towers. Just like any of those games that have the towers and then you unlock an area and you can see where things are. Is there no way to have like a, a map on the screen, no? Because, like, I'm going to get lost very, very quickly. I don't know why that keeps opening up different things. Wow, there's just, there's a lot to do. Did you see the amount that I have to do, even in this area? Yeah, he can, he can climb ladders as well. Okay, I've been up there. Okay, let's see where this ear takes me. There we go. Okay, I've done a backflip. So then a new instinct comes over. Okay, okay. Uh, I guess I have a pet now. Okay. Uh, if I go into quests and go into instincts, how do I... Oh, pin instinct. I see it now. Okay, so pinning an instinct. Yeah, okay. So then go into quests, sorry if you're not understanding this, but I just pinned, I pressed triangle, you can see the controls down the bottom right there, um, I pressed triangle to pin the instinct, to pin an instinct and that cleared the instinct. So use water testing, so do a, okay. I oh, bounce on a trampoline ten times in a row, but I don't think that tarp counts for that. Um, explode, explode an explosive with an explosive. I could have got that earlier on. Explode ten people at the same time. Like someone for one minute. Let's do that. Let's just keep keep my tongue on this guy for a minute. <laughs> Okay, here's a trampoline, so I can probably do the trampoline one at the same time. Oh no, I can't, okay. Uh, one... Oh no, I can, I can. Oh, okay, wow. Okay. Okay. Physics. Physics. Okay, okay. So I'm gonna need to work on that one. <laughs> okay, am I just... Let's say... Where is it? Quests. Let's pin this so that I see when it's done. Uh, pin that. There we go. Like someone for one minute. And yeah, your tongue just like extends like as far as it needs to. Oh, okay, so there you go. So I've now got like 1500 monies, uh, you also can buy like different goats, I'm putting in goats in inverted commas there but you can't see that, um, they're 
are different goats. Obviously, some of them are locked, um, but you can kind of guess what they might be. And then you can, like, run around. None of them are unlockable at the moment, I don't think, because I've not got enough monies. Okay. <laughs> just, uh, like, headbutt people. <laughs> It's just so silly. Okay, I thought I was going to bounce on that, but no. Okay, so th this farmer, it sounds like, has... Okay, okay, I understand, so... Okay, how, how do I impress all the judges? Can I not impress them by doing forward, forward, uh... There you go. Oh, oh wow, okay. I hate goats. <laughs> I'm not going to impress all the judges. Unless I, unless I can, oh I can press the buttons, okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay, what did I get for that? A crown. Okay, so it, it looks like, again, it looks like you can unlock... Oh, this is fun. Uh, you can unlock... different, different tasks as you go along. Yeah, like that. So trespassing, silence the senior. Where's the senior? I'm guessing I just like headbutt them, but... Oh, okay, okay. Okay, so I need to try and get this senior. Just get closer and closer. There you go. Okay, completed. GG, grandma. <laughs> Sorry, that's just so funny. <laughs> GG, Grandma. Okay, where did that teleport to? Headbutt barrel, headbutt barrel. Yeah, yeah, you can see down the bottom what I'm doing. I have no idea where I'm meant to go. I'm guessing the like, I'm meant to. Oh, okay. This door just opens. <laughs> okay. Is this like Wolfenstein? Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh man, this is hilarious. <laughs> Where can I go? Okay, so just like a bunch of... <laughs> and they all got different names? That one was Adele. Adele someday. Yeah, they've all got different names. What is going on? This is so bizarre. And then there's a collectible as well. Okay, get up, get up, get up. There we go, trinket. That's, that's what I've meant by collectible. Let's see if there's anything else to do in here. Because you, you don't really want to, as, as fun as it is, like you don't want to return to somewhere more than more than you need to um this is going to be difficult but not impossible what is up with our skirt <laughs> i'm sorry but that, that's just wrong okay where how do i get out from here okay i need to it looks like i've got a collectible in that chair. Okay, as as it as I get more and more of them, it'll become easier and easier to get rid of them. I'm hoping. Okay. This is just bizarre. This is just so bizarre. What's up with this? Okay, I said it would be easier and easier. There's one left and she's the most challenging one. Okay. Let's go up and get this chair which looks like a collectible. 
Okay. So can I fire? Okay. Don't know. I don't know what that was about. <laughs> Still just lying there. Okay, RIP. Oh, did he fish me? Did he fish me? <laughs> this is just such a silly game. I'm sorry, I got again. I don't know how like entertaining this will be, how fun it will be to watch me play this game, but I just. Like you, you can't, you can't rediscover that that first time look. Okay, am I repulsive at the moment? Okay, let's try and remove that because I don't, I don't like the flies flying around me. How do I remove that? First place loser. I don't know why I got, I got loser. Let's do that. Or were the flies flying around? They might have been flying around that bin. But I think they were flying around me. Yeah, they're definitely flying around me. How do I remove that? Because that's annoying. Um, I suppose I can buy a new... Let's buy... Which one will we buy? Tasty Goat. Let's buy that. Let's switch to Tasty Goat, at least it's in character, the smell, and I'm going to remove the, I'm going to remove that just so that it's nice and clean, I don't know why it removed the crown rather than what was actually wanting to remove, uh, let's keep the crown on, just now. I'll explore, I might, like, I don't know how much, I might do, like, some off-camera, or, you know, I, I don't know. Who's he talking to? Can I not just stand up here and be first? Okay, I'm gonna switch back to goat. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's silly. Okay, what can I do now? <laughs> Is that the reporter that, that kicked me? I think it was, wasn't it? Okay, grinding is really fun. Did I get any... Oh, oh, so I can jump from one to the other. I wonder if you get anything for the amount of time that you grind, or you you will probably have something. Okay, let's go up here, and that's going to bounce me, right? Container tar. And I'm able to wall jump as well, which is kind of redonk. Very silly. Uh, okay. I think can I can I also double jump? No, I think that's a that's a well certainly in the first game I think that was something that you turned on to be able to double jump, which I normally did turn on when I like unlocked the ability. Um, oh, okay. Oops. Okay, I'm just trying to climb this tower, see what's on top. I would imagine that there's some sort of collectible or something that you can get on the top. Obviously it's a bit precarious. The further up you go, the, the more likely it is that you'll fall. Okay, okay, so it's, oh, okay, physics, <laughs> physics please. Sorry, I'm going to try that again. Oh yeah, it was over here, wasn't it? I climbed this one first and then jumped over to the other one. 
Did I do that the last time or was it? I must have done. here and then I don't know why you would okay it's coming up with instructions on how to climb ladders but I'm not next to a ladder but I'll... oh yeah okay the ladders up there okay that will be why the instructions are coming up because it's reading that I'm next to a ladder okay there's a collectible trinket Am I still in the, the first area? Yes, okay. So, like, I mean, I would imagine that it's just like most other games like this there. You can just go to the other area, but you need to use... Okay, and I recognise that item from the first game as well. Um, you... Why is there... why is that... Okay, so how do I use it? Yeah, okay. So there's no, like, proper control of this. Don't get too excited by it. Um, okay, there's no, like, way to properly control it. It's just flying everywhere. Okay, let's turn it off. Okay, I'm, I'm on the edge of the map, I think. Can I, like, am I able to teleport? I know that uh, yeah, I'm able to do that. I'm trying to get to this island to see what's on this. But I'm, I'm flying over the top of it each time. Right, there we go. Oh, it's like Easter Island. Right, that's that island that has the statues. I'm guessing something here. As a secret or you go in their mouth or something. No? I'm just basing a lot of my assumptions like that on the first game. I know I've said it a few times in this episode but they are fairly similar. Oh, you can grind on that. Okay, let's do that. Fun. Okay. Can I steal this car? Yeah. I think the police would have caught me there. Let's, let's chase after the police and see if we can get... do something with the police. They might have despawned. Are the cars all different? Like in terms of like their speed? Because this car is not very fast. Okay, it feels like, yeah, down the bottom, Suburbville. suburbville? Feels like this is a different area. Um, I am going to try and get, let's set, set a waypoint, but I don't know whether that's actually going to show me, I suppose it shows you up the, in the top of the screen and shows you a light beam coming from it. I'm just going to try and unlock this other tower, if that works, and where is the... And then, and then finish this episode. Oh, there it is. Okay. So, synchronize. And I'm guessing this will teleport you. Okay, so what spawns? Is it the people that spawn? Or are they just spawning? 
And coincidence. Is <laughs> that I, uh, IKEA? Okay. So I know that there's that door down the bottom, but there's also it looks like there is something in these doorways, but maybe I'm just imagining it. It doesn't matter what size you are, by the way, like, if you can fit in. There's nothing in here. So what happened in the first game was that the teleport point would be, like, inside those little doorways, and I think they've even used the same model, or a similar model for it. <coughs> Okay, so I'm imagining that each tower will unlock something else, no? Why is that not? Like, I was expecting it to be lit up or something. But there's nothing here that for me to do. Okay, I, I thought there would be another thing lit up and I would unlock another chain in that, but maybe I need to do something in the overworld or something. Hmm, okay. So, anyway, I am going to leave it there, folks. Uh, join us again for another episode of Let's Play Goat Simulator 3 on the PlayStation 5. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe for more. Thanks everyone for watching. See you later. Bye-bye.